have were a lovely boy inside and out. He lit up the room. Wherever he went, he lit up the room. He had lots of friends. He loved his family. He loved his friends. He loved going to the gym. Um, whenever you felt down, he always put a smile back on your face. Um, and it's hard to think, you know, he's gone. Um, it's hard for us as a family. It's, it feels like a dream and it's not happening, but then reality is you and it is happening. Um, to think, you know, we were never going to see him again, you know. Christmases will never be the same, you know. I really don't know how we're going to get through this Christmas without him. Um, it's like, you know, you see all these videos, these lovely videos, that like all these friends put up, and then it suddenly hits you, and you get all these overwhelming emotions you can't control and it's just sad sad for us all sad for his cousins his brother his sister his mom you know and i can't do anything emma's my child you know i watched calambi bone so i watched my baby have her baby now i've watched my baby lose her baby and i can't do anything about that and take that pain away it's a horrible feeling. You just feel sick with the pain, you know, and it's just senseless, you know, what's happened to him, why, you know. It's, you can't accept it, you can't move on. He's with you all the time. Every day is hard. It doesn't matter how big or small. If anybody has got any information, just please get in touch and help us as a family to get justice for Kavan because that's what he deserves. He doesn't deserve to wear what happened to him. Put, your, put themselves in our shoes and what we're feeling. And just do the right thing. That's all we ask, do the right thing for Kavan. The investigation is still ongoing into Kevin's death. We're still actively looking for Ahmed Farah. If you have any information at all that may assist us in finding him, please make contact via 101 or Crime Stoppers. Someone will know something. Please keep Kevin and his family in your minds as they have their first Christmas without him. Thank you.